At dusk, the wind blows gently through fields of cane, singing to Azaka, reporting to concern lower as the red sky begins its journey to dawn. It feels like heaven against a back wet from hours of cutting cane. The first sugarcane plant was brought to Louisiana from Saint Domingue and stuck deep into the rich Gulf Coast soil. Sunshine, water, and dirt. Triometrically opposed, maybe. Taken for granted, yes. Left to rot or drown. But intention is the greatest architect, and prayer becomes the prime mover. Saw cane rose high in the low lying parcels west of the Mississippi, competing with cotton and rice, competing for sunshine, water, dirt, intentions, and prayer. Now, some would argue that the introduction of sugar cane in Latazuni was part of the lowest commitment to protect its followers in foreign lands, with roots literally planted in Louisiana ground. The lower would also flourish in the tumultuous early days of La Louisiane, allowing those that understand access to the mysteries of the Daomi and Congo, transforming fields of cane into proud pitomatans, connecting the spirit world of ancient Guinea to the living world of sunshine, water.
Thank <laughs> you. 